plaintiff, DJNA Smith, dated the defendant, but she claims he was physically abusive, and he once punched her when she was pregnant with their son. DJNA is suing for a loan and emotional distress, and she petitioned the court for a DNA test because the defendant denies paternity of their son. Defendant Benjamin Booker says DJNA is violent, and she not only assaulted him, but she also assaulted his mother. Benjamin claims DeJanae defamed him on social media by claiming he was gay. So he's countersuing for emotional distress and car damages. All rise. This court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Greg Mathis presiding. You may now be seated. Start with you. Okay, I met uh, Mr. Booker in uh, April of 2016. I had just lost my dad. He had just got out of jail, so we kind of comforted each other. Um, I ended up pregnant with our first child right away. She passed away in October of 2016. What, baby? After that, what, baby? he became abusive. Um, I, what is he mean? He's saying what baby? What do you think he's talking Because about? I, I didn't let him baby. come see the baby. Never saw a baby. Because when I called him to tell him that I had the baby, there was he no baby. told me to um, there was no baby. call the ambulance. I'm drunk. All right. So there was no baby. Um, I heard, sir. That's enough. <laughs> Go ahead. We got. I got pregnant again with our son that we have now, who was 11 months, Judge. Um, April of 2017, I had complications. I needed to go to the hospital. I was driving. Mr. Booker was insecure. He punched me in my face trying to get my phone while I was driving. I pulled over. I called the police. After you hit he me? He took my keys out of the ignition, and he was arrested. I have you the police it, report dude. right here. He sat in county for two weeks till I dropped the charges. Um, I had our son in August of 2017. He was there through the whole pregnancy. He was there when our son was born. In January of 2018, Your Honor, driving back down his, his mother's driveway where he threw a rock at my window and bust my passenger door. Because you cursed me. I then drove up the driveway, knocking on the door. His mother let him beat me up in you front of her. You pushed my mother down. And here's the picture. Let me see it, please. I'm gonna let him talk, sir. What do you want to say? Your Honor, I, that, the, day, the day that she's talking about right now, she's texting me, talking crazy to me on the phone. I come to the house. I come in. She say, watch the baby, B, and close the door and walk out the door. And I'm like, what? So I went back outside. She pulled out very fast. When she pulled out the driveway real fast, I was so mad, I picked up a rock and threw it at her. Now, she done broke my windows before. She did a lot of vandalism to my house, so that's why I had did that. So then she came back, knocking on the, bamming on the door, about to break the door down. My mother comes to the door. She pushes my mother out of the way. When she pushes my mother out of the way, I reacted. She knocked my mother down. My mother's right here. What I knocked... happened in the car earlier, the other incident, where you were locked up for two weeks? She hit me. While driving? While she was driving, she hit me. What'd she do? Yeah. <laughs> no, she... <laughs> With my phone in the hand, in my hand, okay. That's what you say, that's your claim. Oh. She's very, she's very, she's, she's, That's why you spent two weeks in there. If you told him that story. She's very, she, she, she has big hands. Bit before? You she ever got go to big prison? hands. You ever go to prison? She got big hands. Yes. She yeah, knows, yeah. Uh, yeah, I see why. If he coming with that type of story to a judge, they won't even give him a chance to finish. He's a six-pound convicted felon. lock you up in the mid-sentence if you told him some stuff like that. All right, so go ahead. She did that, and then what happened? I got out of the car to get away from her. Mm -hmm. I always get out of the car because she's very violent. She always hits you, you say? Yeah, she always hits Give me some incidents because she is giving me two. I got an incident where we were in the car. We had an argument. So I jumped out of the car because she she would be violent. She would hit me and then she would call the police and have me locked up. It's the same one or a different one? No, this is different. Another car fight. Yes. Who's driving this time? Me. She, she doesn't driving. have license. They're revoked. She was driving. Go ahead. She punched you again? Yes. While driving? Yes. Is that the only time she punches you? That's when she <laughs> gets when, when they don't get in the car with her anymore. He called the police. <laughs> Ma'am, what are you suing for? Let's get to the um, loan. I'm and suing the... for emotional distress because he left in April. He put some inappropriate pictures of me in a hotel on Facebook. The reason why we was in the hotel is because his mother water was off for eight months. 
Sir, did you post inappropriate activities I of po her? Yes, and I have a police report for that. I posted inappropriate stuff about because she put my whole social security number on Facebook, and then she's on there talking about I'm gay, which is not true. I'm all type of these things. She's just saying bitter stuff on live on Facebook talking about me. So after a you while... You have that? We have... She yeah, showed yeah. me hers. We have... Your Honor, we have... We have been going through this for a lot. I'm mm -hmm. not going to deny your Where honor. social security number? I got let a me, police report Let me read it off. I know we got a couple car crackers in here. <laughs> 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 I'm going to read it off. We in Chicago, too. Mm -hmm. the, capital, the capital of car cracking. And it right here. Let's prove your case. Give me that social security. Give it to me. And the date of birth. <laughs> we going to all have some credit cards around here. <laughs> <laughs> And you made the gay reference to him, ma'am? Um, I got the text messages. So I just is, let people uh, know. The this text is, messages. This is what she put on Facebook about me. All right. So you have invaded her privacy and uh, hurt her reputation by publishing private facts. And secondly, you have defamed him, alleging he's gay and he's offended by it. And it's not true when you did it to hurt his reputation, he says, and he believes it did hurt his reputation. What do you have there you're trying to I loaned you? him $1,500. Here's the text message on March 7th, it, please. 17th. I would do <laughs> it because I got... Benny has six kids. I got tired of him complaining about he can't take care of his kids, he can't get a job. Stop lying. So I decided to loan him the he was money. A liar. Because. Let her finish, sir. Go ahead, ma'am. I felt bad for his kids. <laughs> I told him I needed my money back April 18th. He has failed to pay for it. My uh, god sister right here is a witness. She went with me to drop off the money to him. You wanted to speak yes, or not? Yes, absolutely. State your name? Candace. What do you want to tell us today? Um, I don't I'm even know her. Be quiet. <laughs> Go ahead. You... Go ahead, ma'am. Okay. I'm just a witness for my, my god sister right mm -hmm. here. Um, just witnessed her giving him the money, money, what have you, taking her to the bank to go get it for him. Okay. So you have six kids. Are you paying your child support on those six or caring for them in the house or something? When I you can. meeting your financial responsibilities. Yeah. Okay. And for him to borrow money to meet him is admirable. If he borrowed money, as you say, to support his kids, my hat's off to him for that. I never uh, borrowed anything from her. Yes, you did. You got some money from this woman. I'm looking at I it. I got some you money, but I never borrowed it. it. You tell she me what happened me. then. She gave it to me. Um... Your Honor, she gave me... So... Your Honor, she gave me the I money. I got you. You okay. look like you deserve gifts from a woman. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Exactly. All know. right. So there you go. Um, <laughs> well, maybe I should take a poll. How many women in here believe he deserves gifts from them? <laughs> Not one. <laughs> zero. <laughs> Not one. <laughs> zero. <laughs> zero. All right. <laughs> so the DNA. Your Why did you need yep. a DNA he test? We have the results. Okay. So he was there from when the baby was born. He was there from when I was pregnant. We get the child support court, and he's behind. He says to the judge, he wants a DNA test. The judge said, you signed the volunteer knowledge of paternity, sir. After you You're tricked me into signing it. Here. He's behind on his child support. Trick me into signing it, please. That. He's getting ready to go to jail on the 10th. You just want to see me in jail, I know. You need to take care of your kids. Good take care of your kids. I do. Sir, what do you say regarding the child and the DNA test she's requesting? Your Honor, I go through her phone and she has this so-called best friend who's a male, who she talks to all the time, tells all my business to. Who, she tells everybody my business, but that's neither here nor there. So, I'm going through the phone, she said, and she texted somebody and said, oh, my baby father just died. Her best friend had got killed, like, a couple months before that. She said, my baby father just died. So I'm like, what? And I got a picture of him. He looks just like my son. <laughs> He looks just like me. And when you mention it to her, what has she said? Is this you? Oh, I, I was just saying that to somebody just to say something. I'm like, what? did you ever say that? No, I have not. Um, She's lying. Your Honor, I would never just throw a baby on him. He doesn't have anything for me to throw a baby on him. If my deceased friend was the father, I'd be getting a $752 Honor, check she, a month. Why would I? She tricked me and said she had ovarian cancer, and if, if I got her pregnant, that the tumor would get smaller. She tricked me into getting pregnant. I tricked you to make a baby. Ugh. Here's our son. Here, I got more pictures. Let's see it. Nah, this baby looked more like you if right. I had to guess. I'm not denying the baby don't look like me. I, okay. I just had the baby yesterday. All right, but you just want to know right. since she was playing games. Exactly. All right. And uh, the counterclaim, what car damages are you suing her for? Okay, so earlier that day, 
I, I'm getting text messages from her. She's saying, she always says my baby's sick or something wrong just to get some, some attention from me. She texts me from Google numbers, from all you? type of stuff. So I'm, I'm getting the text. I'm not even answering because I know she's lying. I'm riding down the street. Next thing I know, she gets behind me. I'm like, how is she in the hospital with my baby? She got behind me. So I just kept driving. I get to the store. When I walked off, she picks up a rock and scratches my car. So I ran over there, and I hit her in the face. She said, oh, I'm finna call the police. I said, go ahead, and I sat there. The police came. We both had a sign of refusal because she scratched my car. <laughs> I got, I got the pictures of the car scratched. Sir, it is not a legal defense to hit a woman in the face. Right. Because That's why I had a domestic. Because scratch your car. So, ma'am, how did, um, did you damage car, his car? No. My cousin was there for that incident. Uh, she always there. She, she everywhere. <laughs> she too many places at one time. That car... I'm sending y'all right back to Maywood with this mess. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give you your $1,500 loan because I believe it. I believed I was a loan. And, in fact, you gave me text messages indicating that it was a loan. Those Were are Were you phony. going to have my $1,500 defended? I'll have it. Those are phony, sir. She does Google fake Google mm. messages. 1500 for you. That's it. No emotional distress. The only person needs to get that today is me. <laughs> get, the, get the DNA test. Okay. And yours is dismissed. You haven't proven that she caused these car damages. And pay your child support. You are the father. Yes. Amen. Have a good day. Amen. Amen. The plane. Your plane dismissed. And I have that, honey. Talking about it ain't his baby. What? Your son needs some shoes. You need to quit lying. You'll be in jail. Don't worry about it. You back. I know you want me in jail. You I know you want me in jail. That's all. You, you've been trying to get me in jail for the longest time. Sitting there with you... the for a little while. You ain't gonna get nobody like better it. than me. I know you, you bitter. You broke. You, you live with your mama in you a bitter. close home. Shorty, you she need to pay her comment bill. Just came in the mail.